Good day fellas, I hope you are ready for your extra daily dose of skill. Today we are going to play with Panzer Cover 1. I never thought I am going to say that, but it's pretty much German version of the Cover 1. Yeah, I know, sounds quite weird, don't you think so? Anyways, I played one game before recording the video and the things went pretty well. I managed to craft 3000 damage or something like this. So fingers crossed we are going to be able to do the same thing now. Um, and hopefully everything will go the same way. Now, the main difference between Russian cover 1 and German cover 1. Obviously German cover 1 has a cupola on top. I don't know how um, armored cupola is but you know cupola is cupola and usually cupola is a weak spot now moving forward we have 75 millimeters of um, gun right 110 alpha damage so compared to the russian 160 iii dios mios uh, penetration 115 and with a gold you have 162 so it doesn't look like this vehicle is uh, like super innovative or the best tank in the world of tanks or something for me this vehicle is looking like it is uh, uh, pretty much cover one and there is a different gun on the cover one that's about it well and plus plus on top of that you are getting extra um, cupola on top of that as a bonus of having a new gun right this is how the things are looking like to me and this is how I feel like about this situation uh, and you know, I am being honest. I'm just simply saying things straight in the face now What I definitely noticed is people are bouncing this tank whenever they are shooting standard ammunition Believe me or not this tank it looks like this tank has a bit of the armor and this is quite a nice thing right um, well until someone is loading the gold because i can promise you that many many people will simply load gold and they will say mm -hmm. good one good one buddy good one this is how i feel like now luckily we found the cover 1a or cover 1sa uh, who is not willing to shoot the gold and he is trying to side scrap against us and you know in this kind of situation there is no need for me not to shoot uh, uh, the gold ammunition against the heavy tanks there is simply no uh, it is completely useless for me to simply bounce him for three days right so we are thinking ahead we loaded apcrs and we are having a blast fellas okay Let's try to get a bit more involved. Let's see. Can we destroy this gentleman or we cannot? This is the question now. Okay. I don't really think this, uh, this cover one is very experienced player. By the way, I don't know. Can you notice that? But I have a mini lags somehow. By the way, as you can see, armor of this tank truly works pretty fine. I mean, I, I would love to say something else, but armor is actually looking very decent. You know what? After this game, we are going to go to the um, tanks GG just to check it out. Uh, am I am I special or the armor just feels better than cover one armor, you know? Or maybe I just met um, players who are not the best players in the world of tanks. Also could be very uh, possible, right? By the way, at this point, I just want to track this gentleman. That's what we are looking for. Beautiful. And now we want to eliminate him from the game. By the way, I can definitely feel lags. I can definitely feel lags, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Hi. Good. This is exactly what I was looking for. And now we need to figure out how to eliminate this 82. Nice. Okay, 82 is down. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Now the question is, how we supposed to get more? It doesn't look like a bad tank, fellas. Once again, there is two options. Either we have met tourists, aka newer players in the world of tanks, not so experienced players in the world of tanks. Or alternatively, this tank is just looking uh, um, quite powerful, right? And we will, ch we will check the things out, believe me. I can promise you that it will take us a moment to check out the armor on the tanks GG out of curiosity, right? Or I suppose to say out of sports interest. 
Okay. Interesting. I am getting spotted by someone sniping from the back. I see. What I want to see... I want to see if someone will try to go back for a base defense. Doesn't look like it. Okay. What is the right choice for us? There is two options how enemies can play. Enemies can try to make pressure like this or enemies can try to make pressure all the way around. I have a feeling in this kind of situation um, we need to see enemies... Well, I would love to see enemies going uh, around, you know, but unfortunately this is not the case, okay? I am lagging, fellas. I apologize for this. And this look, I see the guy in the back, but... I don't really think it is fault of mine, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Everyone is complaining about the lag in this kind of situation. So I assume this is um, this is a bit of the World of Tanks server's fault, if I can say so. Anyways, we are feeling all right. We are good, fellas. We are good. We are fine. Good. Even against the gold ammunition, we are bound. They are bouncing once in a while. Or I suppose to say they are not penetrating us all the time. Very impressive. Wow. I am kind of shocked how good this vehicle is looking like. We will compare this against the cover one and we will know absolutely everything about this tank. Right? Right in the moment. Now beautiful flanking. Excellent. Now this M10 will shit his pants. Surprise. He's probably thinking, what is that? That is your death, my man. That is your death. Beautiful. Nice flanking. And in the end of the day, I assume we are going to win this game without bigger problems whatsoever. Uh, what is the goal for us? Wow, it is lagging so hard. What is the option for us is obviously to make as much pressure as we can for uh, this T-34-3 and Churchill-3. And we are going to be all right. I think we are going to be alright. Also, please keep this in mind, there is ELC base somewhere, uh, somewhere sniping from the back, I assume. I assume this gentleman is sniping somewhere from the back, that's what I can tell you. Okay, our cover one saw, by the way, cover one saw review is coming very, very soon, or I suppose to say first impressions. Obviously, I will need to dig into the tank a bit, be, uh, a bit deeper to play more games, but currently I'm trying to um, go as hard as possible on the higher tier tanks, you know? Uh, so this is the thing. Anyways. Hi. This gentleman is officially messed up. It feels like this tank actually has armor. Wow. So weird. So weird, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. So weird. It feels like this tank is quite powerful. Even though, once again, I was quite skeptic whenever I've seen this tank. I, I mean, I've said, uh, like, cover one from the German side with, uh, you know, German accuracy, if I can say so. Although... I do not really mind the Russian gun whatsoever. You know, 160 alpha damage, alpha damage matters in many, many situations. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Let's try to find the CLC. Now the question is, where is this bugger sitting at? If I need to guess... If I need to guess, fellas. I would say this bugger is sitting somewhere here. This would be my prediction. Obviously, he can be a bit deeper here and even somewhere near the red line, but I believe, fellas, he is going to be a bit closer. Once again, I apologize for that lag spikes. There is absolutely nothing what I can do about this. This is the server lag. Am I playing in the L2? This is the question. Let me check it out. Yeah, L2 lag spikes. Oh, look how many players do we have. 192,000 players. Oy, 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 oy. Well, not a big surprise, I would say. Not a big surprise the game is lagging a bit. This is a lot of people, fellas. Wow. I haven't seen those numbers in, in a very, very long time. Hmm. 
Is he sitting here on the corner? Right here? I'm trying to figure out where this gentleman is sitting at. No! ELC! Traveling all over the place and we did not manage to find him. I do not know what I supposed to say. Well. Victory is victory. Let's go. Okay, and we are back. We have made 1,900 uh, 1, damage, a bit of assisting damage, and couple of kills. Hip, hip, hooray. In the end of the day, we are top by experience, we are top by the damage, and we have quite a bit of the profits as well. Now, important thing to say, like I said, I played a warming up round with this vehicle because I had no clue what this tank is all about, right? And the warming up round was 2.7 thousand damage. And 1.5 base experience. And not an ace. What is this mother trucker made of? This is the question. And you know what? Let's hide the camera for a moment. Let's share the screen. Um, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, let's take a look at this tank armor. Okay, first of all, standard cover one, okay? Speaking about the standard cover one, armor of the standard cover one is pretty much 80... Um, 80 millimeters in front, some plates are 60 millimeters, some plates are 100 millimeters, and turret is, let's say, 90 millimeters to 100, and in certain angles, you have 600, you know, but let's get real, people are going to shoot you into the mountlet anyways, right? And now, let's check out this German one, because it is bouncing a lot, and I am very, very surprised... <laughs> Excuse me, how good this vehicle is behaving. Now looking into the 3D model, fellas. It's the same thing. It's pretty much the same thing. Why people are bouncing this tank? It's even easier to penetrate this tank in the face. Okay, understood. So, what do we have from all of this? People are simply not really experienced to play with this vehicle. How you are penetrating this tank, Cupola, how you are penetrating this tank in the face, and so on, so on. You know, it's not like the most powerful tank in the world of tanks. It is just not the case, right? This is how it looks like. Also, I am very curious how much do, will we need to do in order to mark this tank as well. This is going to be interesting. But first impressions, I don't mind it. I do not hate it. Let's say like that. Let's go for another one okay fellas what do we have we have empires border and we have a tier for matchmaking this is going to be a slaughterhouse i repeat this is going to be a slaughterhouse here at least that's what i want to believe fingers crossed so what we are doing we are teleporting to the to the hotel three hotel uh, four position um i think this is where you should play with this vehicle. This is how I feel like. Wait a second. There is some tier 6s. Oh, lucky bastards. I just noticed there is a Cromwell and T50. Wow, they should feel great about this much waking. Well, minus map because this map is quite horrible for... Uh, um, for lightly armored vehicles. But, you know, in a way, in the lower tier, no one has armor if you have the right ammunition. This is what Gold Noob said, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Anyways, what do we want to do? We want to take upper position. Maybe I even want to push through the middle of the field eventually? This is the question. Huh. Maybe this is what I want to do, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Let me think. By the way... One highlight which I really want to say, I have seen many, many people making such a silly goose mistake to um, push this side from the south. It's not really worth it. Take upper side, if enemies push like this, they are going to get themselves into the crossfire. It is extremely important thing to highlight. By the way, that was... Okay, big boy. How are you doing? Okay, I am fine. You see, this is what I'm talking about. If enemies will try to get involved, they are going to get into the crossfire. And you know, he's the one who lost pretty much most of his hit points and uh, 
um, he is not feeling happy about this. I can guarantee you that. Now, speaking about Matildas. Oy, oy how many Matildas to farm. Greetings, fellas. Oy, I am feeling bad, fellas. And I'm pe feeling bad not because, you know, I ate a... Out of... Um, I ate a bad schnitzel or something. I'm feeling bad for a lower tiers to... Uh, to even have much making like this and to meet tanks like our one in the tier of four, you know? Although Matilda, don't worry, Matilda is not feeling bad whatsoever. Matilda will load their full gold and Matilda will spank me like there is no tomorrow. I need to be careful with this. Meanwhile, Cromwell is trying to make a bit of pressure. Cromwell doesn't care about this game, I assume. Or Cromwell is just simply, you know, pushing the W key as much as he physically and possibly can. Okay, the whole idea is simple. We want to clear those two gentlemen sitting here. We have Stuck to support us. We have Su to support us. I believe we can get involved to the maximum. That's what I believe. Beautiful, very, very nice. Once again, I know it. the game is feeling a bit twitchy. I am very, very well aware of that, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, but I cannot do absolutely anything. I can feel this lag yourself. It's not a YouTube video or something. It is It is the game at this point. You know, when there is 200,000 people playing the game, 194,000 people. Um, I believe server has a bit of the problems and there is nothing. I repeat nothing what I can change about this. Well, maybe switch server or go to the L3 or L1. Maybe that could help. But yeah, either way. Good. So far we have done 1.2 thousand. But the biggest problem of all this is I think we are done with this game. I really doubt we are going to be able to reach any more tanks. So the low tier is a blessing in, in a sense. And low tier is a curse as well, because there is simply not that much hit points to farm. Shame. Let's teleport to the scoreboard and let's see how our team performed, shall we? Okay, fellas, we are back from the second game. 1.2 thousand damage, 500 assisting damage, hip hip hooray. That was, that was okay game, you know, we went in front, we... Did as much as we physically and possibly could. And in the end of the day, uh, this is as much as we managed to craft. 81,000 profits for a tier 5 shitter. Not bad whatsoever. Let's go for the round number 3. Let's go. Okay, last but not least, we have best field and counter battle. This could be the best game ever for this session. Well, at least I hope for that. So... Uh, we will try to play hold down. Hopefully this will work. Although obviously if we are not going to have anyone going together with us. We are going to have a quite a bit of the problem. But let's see. You know what? I believe this is a lower tier. I'm changing the plan. Skill you believe this is a lower tier? Oh yeah, you can see that yourself. Listen, I am changing the plan. I'm not going to go to play hold down here. Um, because I'm not entirely sure will my gun depression be able to deal with this. I am just going to play here. Right? Uh, we met the first victim of ours. Oh, yo, derp gun. Oh. Yeah, he is not buying it. He is not enjoying it. He is saying, ay, 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 Dios mios. I think this is exactly what this gentleman is saying. Okay, good. Good start for us, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Very good start for us. I am kind of going to ignore this Oi Experimental at this point. Oi, 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 it's so twitchy. It is so twitchy, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. But there is nothing what I can do about this. Wow. Madness. Madness, fellas. Okay. Cover 220 weak spot is um, turret, by the way, if you are wondering. So, this is the main reason why I'm trying to mess this guy that much. So far, everything is looking alright. If we will keep going like this, there is a big chance we are going to get the very first ace. Obviously, a lot of things are depending on the luck, you know? Uh, and speaking about the luck, our team is capping the base. I really do not want to see and you know, be captured out, but I don't really think we have uh, anything to do with it, you know? 
It depends on the enemy team. They will decap the base or they won't decap the base at this point. Good. Oh, experimental. He is officially dead, I would say. Nice. And now we can start flanking enemies a bit like this. Beautiful. So far, everything is looking great. And plus on top of that, our team is not capping the base either. So this is this is a definitely a positive thing. Okay, understood. Cover one S, understood. He is he is like angry Chihuahua. I need to be smarter. I cannot simply push on him because it's not going to be worth it, right? That's what I can tell you. Yes, we are looking at him angry. But obviously he is not our priority at this point. At this point I want to punish everyone who is who is overconfident in this Syria. Okay. Hello dear big boy. Beautiful. Once once again, fellas, I believe that is very, very fair. And this is quite easy to understand. I am just trying to clear one side, you know? This is what I'm trying to do. Beautiful. Very, very nice. If you are wondering how can I play with this kind of lag, I can. It is not the most pleasant experience, but I can. Okay. Mm -hmm. After this, we need to deal with this gentleman. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, he has auto loader. I never played with their tank either, but I am trying to figure out. Can I, can I beat him? Okay, good. Next. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, he has extremely good penetration. Oi, 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 oi. Okay, fine. Auto aim will work just okay. Yes, yes, yes. I see. I see, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. I see. Don't you worry. I pay attention. I see the other guy in the side as well. This tank. <laughs> Holy bananas this tank. What just happened? Fellas, I felt like I went into the full berserk mode. I felt like I I was like a fish in the water, you know? Wow. Wow, fellas. Obviously, I paid humongous attention what happened there, okay? I paid humongous attention at all of this. And uh, we managed to spank them left, right, and center. Wow. Although I think with this tank in order to feel um, successful and in order to feel uh, great, you need to have quite a bit of the gold ammunition as well. It's not, in other words, it's not so simple, right? Anyways, let's teleport in to the um, scoreboard, shall we? Yeah, I thought so, fellas. A solid ace uh, for this performance. I think we deserve this. Look at this. Ace, top gun, high caliber. Uh, steel wall, 3.7 thousand damage, 7 kills, uh, 1.9 thousand base experience. 1.9 thousand base, fellas. And even with all of this gold spam, we managed to um, pretty much farm 50 thousand credits. Absolutely ridiculous of the vehicle that is. I don't know, maybe I am extremely lucky and happy and everything with this much making. You, you know, I mean... I don't even know what I'm supposed to say, or either this vehicle feels that good. From armor-wise, I did not notice, like, uh, armor is actually working on this tank, but maybe it, work, it works just because of the lags which we are having in the game. I cannot explain this other how, uh, you know, absolutely nuts. Uh, anyways, in the four games... Our performance is 2.4 thousand damage and 100 assisting damage, although uh, you haven't seen the first game because I did not even record it. I just simply went for it um, to see how this tank is looking like overall. Absolutely madness of the vehicle. Wow. It, ple it pleasantly surprised me. Obviously, if you have something to add to my um, comments, feel free to do so. Uh, I am shocked. I am shocked how good... 
this tier 5 felt. Anyways, thank you very much for watching and see you very very soon. Skill is out for today. Peace.